Hey Vikes, I'm Tara. And I'm Alex. And you're watching SVTV. Here are your daily announcements. The SHS Choir is hosting their first concert in more than a year tonight at 7 o'clock. Senior waiver turn-in will be Wednesday, May 5th during lunch. Washburn Tech or shortened schedule students may turn their waiver into Miss Geis in room N14 before they leave on Wednesday. USD 345 students and staff are eligible to receive the first dose of the COVID-19 vaccine May 6th at SHS. Make sure to check Schoology for more information. May 6th is the last day to sign up for driver's ed. There will be a meeting during CALP in the auditorium on Wednesday for those students who have already signed up. Make sure to see Mr. Tinsley if you have any questions. If you are interested in joining players next school year, there will be a clinic after school May 11th and auditions will be May 12th from 3.30 to 5.30 p.m. If interested, make sure to fill out an application and teacher evaluation form. And contact Mr. Stoffer with any questions. The Fishing Club is reimbursing students that have purchased a fishing license this year. Bring your fishing license to Mr. Wilson in room N8 and he will get you a Seaman Bank check for the cost of a single year license. Tuesday, May 4th, Kaylor has in camp with sign with Highland Community College for an eSports gaming scholarship. Congratulations, Kaylor. Congratulations to SBTV for earning an award of commendation from the Kansas Scholastic Press Association. Sophomores and juniors, there will be a meeting today during CALP if you are interested in attending the annual week-long trip to Washington, D.C. Additional information is on Schoology. Congratulations to Kane Fox for being selected to the Gannett Kansas 2021 All-State Academic Team. Caden was one of the 30 chosen out of 250 nominations. Great job, Caden. Now over to sports after this quick commercial break. Are you interested in learning Russian next year? For free? Or maybe even earning three college credits per semester? Join the upcoming KU Slavic webinar on May 4th and see what this class can do for you. Students are even eligible for an introductory lesson on May 11th. Sign up on Schoology now. Congratulations to the boys golf team for their fourth place finish at the Centennial League Tournament. Individual medalists were Gavin Wilhelm in seventh and Jake Moss in ninth. Congratulations, boys. Wednesday, May 5th, Casey Tanner will sign a letter of intent to play soccer at Baker University. Congratulations, Casey. Congratulations to the 20 athletes who set a personal record at the track meet last Friday night. The track and the track and field coaching staff would like to offer a huge thank you to all who came out and supported the 39th running of the Invitational Relays last Friday night. Tonight is Spirit Night for the girls' soccer team. They are playing against Hayden, so make sure to wear all black. During halftime of the Varsity Girls game, they will be giving out free pizza and candy. JV starts at 4.30 and Varsity starts at 6.15. Make sure to come out and support your lady bikes. Now let's go learn more about the senior deadlines with Allie Reed. What's up, Vikes? I'm here with Alex to talk about everything you need to know before the end of the school year. So, take it away. 
Okay. Well, first thing is we only seniors, you only have about three weeks left, two weeks really in finals to get everything done so that you can, when you walk across the stage, you are conscious free that you are graduating without having to come back and do extra classwork so you can actually get your diploma. So that's the number one thing. You need to finish strong and get after it. Okay, number two is, let's talk about your last week a little bit. Okay, your last week, you'll be getting checkout sheets that will have any money that you owe to the school, and that all has to be paid um, by the 14th, so you can get your cap and gown, which cap and gowns will be distributed along with your CUME folder after graduation practice on the 14th, Friday the 14th. So your week looks something like this. You'll get those uh, sheets that you can check out sheets that you can have teachers sign and everything. And then on Tuesday, you're going to have finals two and four. On Wednesday, you're going to have finals one, three, five, and seven. And on Thursday, the college algebra finals at eight to 10 in the morning. And then you'll have finals six and eight on that day. And then graduation practice will be at eight, will be at 10, 10 on Friday and that lasts about an hour, then we'll have checkout, and then we'll have out on the Alumni Park, we'll have the cookout, and then we will be graduating on um, Sunday. And right now it looks like we're gonna be back at the Expo Center at four o'clock, and there will be no limit to the number of people you can bring. So hopefully that all still is gonna be um, working out. So those are the kind of the quick things. There is laptop check-in. Everybody has to check in their laptop. Seniors, you, your parents did get an email that um, allows you to buy your laptop, but you still have to check it in. They'll erase everything on it, and then they'll give it back to you. And you, it costs, I think, $350. So that, you have to fill out the form that you want it by May 7th. If you do it after that, you won't get your laptop. And then you have to have it paid by the 13th. And so it'll be put on your account that you can pay it by credit card or you can pay it at the central office. So I think seniors, that's all you need to know. Everybody else, you don't, you're not done until the 26th, so you got an extra two weeks to keep pushing and get those grades going so you don't have to spend your summer at Seaman High School going to summer school. Okay, that's it. Thanks, Alex. Finish strong this year, Vikes. Now back to your anchors. That's all we have for today, Vikes. May the fourth be with you.